Ariel, listen to me. The human world, it's a mess. Life under the sea is better than anything they got up there. The seaweed is always green. Well, the first thing that I'm going to use is the lasting eyeshadow and cream puff. This is going to help to keep all the eyeshadow colors in place. I'm going to press it on and build up under the brow. That blow fish blow! So I'm going to take a little bit of the blue and a little bit of the yellow and mix it in with my cream puff. Put this by the lash line so you can see it's changed the shade. So have fun with your eyeshadows, ladies. Take this across the lash line and up to the crease. The seaweed is always greener in some body. I'm going to add a little bit of drama, and we're going to do this with the black, just on the outside of the eye. I'm actually going to just put a little bit of the darkness on the outside corner. This is a new palette. This would be very fun for your masquerade. So if you're doing this by yourself, these shades, you could create a lot of different looks from this. What I'm going to do is use a soft touch eye pencil. It's a cream eyeliner and we're gonna go, since we're going for a color, we're gonna use a navy. See, darling, it's better down where it's wetter. Take it from me. I'm on the shore, they work all day. I'll win this up. And what this is going to do, it's going to give you just variation of shades. Again, our Wicked Black Mascara, it's a lengthening and voluming. Um, the barrel is nice and wide. And see how she's zigzagging and rolling as she's pushing upward. That's going to give you a lot of length. And especially at the ends, you want it a little thicker. And once you have your top lashes done, take a little bit and just go back and forth on those bottom lashes and then go down. So now to add a little fun factor to it, we're going to apply some of the rhinestones. Under the sea. Nobody beat us, fry us, and eat us in fricassee. We want the land folks loves to cook. And then since we're going full-fledged color, we're actually going to add the color to her lips then also. Same thing, since the lasting cream puff is safe to use on the eyes, I'm actually going to use it again to mix the color together. It's a little bit of blue eyeshadow with a little bit of yellow. I'm 